today represents a dark cloud over the beautiful, peaceful town we love dearly. Accusations of corruption in a Piedmont Police Department leading to a major shakeup. Pilot Mountain officials detailed a years long pattern of alleged misconduct and corruption within its own police department. Thank you for watching the Fox 8 5 o'clock news. I'm Katie Nordine and I'm Neil McNeil. We now know Police Chief Robbie Jackson has stepped down and the city fired former Chief Daryl Bottoms. Sergeant Jason Crismon and Officer Ryan Blizzard are on administrative leave with pay. And this action comes after an investigation found people who worked in the department defrauded nonprofit organizations. Fox A's Caroline Boyer joins us now live in Pilot Mountain in Surrey County tonight. And you learned this involved some nonprofit organizations, right, Caroline? Neil, I talked with the executive director of Pilot Mountain Unites, and she tells me she had no idea this was going on. She says it involves the Hot Nights Hot Cars event, which is huge in this town and happens six times per year. She would hire officers and then pay them directly. As of now, town leaders say this alleged fraud scheme was happening between 2019 and 2022. Sooner or later, you get caught. It's a shock to the people living in this small town. It's a sad commentary of our time. But for every one bad apple, there are hundreds of others, very dedicated, wonderful people trying to do the best they can. Learning the officers who took an oath to protect and serve reportedly took advantage of nonprofit organizations. I don't trust them. Our goal is to rebuild that trust. We commit to you today to reform our police department to embody the values of our community. The work to rebuild started Thursday. Today also marks a new day in Pilot Mountain, a renewal of our commitment to do right by our community. The investigation into the Pilot Mountain Police Department started with an anonymous tip to the district attorney. Town leaders don't know the full extent of this scheme yet, but do believe nonprofit organizations who paid off duty officers for security at events were the primary targets. A town spokesperson tells me in some cases, officers were not showing up to events they were paid to work. In others, they were getting paid by the nonprofit and police department at the same time. This new chief promised us there's going to be a big turnaround. Detective Adrian Tillotson is serving as interim chief and is partnering with the Surrey County Sheriff's Office to help fill in the gaps of service until he can hire more officers. Tillotson admitted this is not how he'd imagine he'd become interim chief. Being named chief of police is a role that one day I hope to fill, however, not under these, these cloudy circumstances. Um, I'm committed to leading our police department with transparency and accountability. They're cleaning their own house. They're doing the best they can. So let's support them. This is an ongoing investigation. Town leaders expect they'll have more information for us in the coming weeks. Right now, it's not clear if anyone from the police department will face criminal charges. Live in Pilot Mountain, Caroline Boyer, Fox 8 News.